and gently let your hands go into your belly, into your abdomen and just feel your breath. Feel how it becomes bigger and how when you exhale you let go all the air out and it becomes small. So feel, feel your abdomen, feel your belly and we're going to play this game which is called filling up a balloon. So you're going to feel your belly like if it's a balloon with your breath. So fill up your balloon and exhale your balloon. <sighs> but now this balloon has a color. So you visualize which color you want your balloon to be. So let the color come to you as a big beautiful balloon and let your belly turn into that color. Breathing gently, slowly. Exhaling gently, deeply. Ah. Inhale. And let your balloon be beautiful and big and full of air. Ah, and just let it go. Let all the air out. But keep the color. That color is the gift for you. So you're going to keep that color in your heart. Ah. We can make some friction coming back with our hands a couple of times until we feel the warmth and the heat of our own energy. And let's take that color into our heart and just feel that experience, your inner balloon, your inner color. <sighs> and gently we come back into our room, into the room by opening our eyes. <sighs> so they were like, <coughs> What color was your balloon? <laughs> they were curious. Curiosity, right? That's the inner child in them. So your balloon, what color was it? Because red. 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 Blue. Blue. Orange. Orange. Yellow. 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 So I think we have a rainbow, don't we? So we are all a beautiful rainbow together. So how exciting. So those colors, they live inside of us. They live outside of us. They're beautiful. They feel our world with beauty. When we walk into a garden and we smell the flowers, our eyes become so happy of seeing the beautiful colors of the trees, of the mountains, of the earth, of the sky. And those colors, they are outside, but they're also inside. And that's the subject for today, our inner rainbow. Do you know you had a rainbow inside of you? Yes many of you already knew. But some of you, this is new. So just say, hello. Hello, Rainbow. <laughs> We're going to see how these rainbows develop, how they live inside of us, and how can, how can we make this rainbow uh, brighter? How can we make our inner rainbow shine? nicer, bigger, more beautiful. <coughs> so it begins, it begins when we're in the wound, 0 to 12. 
इस्तेमाल that first color that first center which is red and it has the element of the earth and it's the feeling of grounding a feeling that you belong a feeling that oh it's so good to be here it's good to have it's good to live and that's the first feeling a little baby has in their mother's womb. So it's so important when a woman is pregnant to feel that just being pregnant is so beautiful, it's such a beautiful gift. Because that child, right in that moment, is developing the sense of being, the sense of belonging. And the affirmation for that center is, I feel good now. So we can all say it. And we can touch that center. And it's really low. It's, it could be like in the coccyx, in the coccyx, like right underneath our tailbone. That's where the, our first center becomes. And it's the root center. And as a tree, it's so important to have that strong rooted, to be really rooted into the earth. So, because it will become like, like it will grow, like a baby will grow, that's the first thing. That's like the first stair, the, the step of a stair, to be rooted. So we all say, ah, I feel, Good here. Now. Now. I feel good here and now. Ah. Just to be. Just to be here. Isn't it wonderful that you can connect into that center and make it strong? What happens when you don't feel that you belong? What happens when you have a feeling that you don't belong to a place? It means that you need to pay attention to that center. And something that will help you in that center is something related to the earth, like planting a tree, or just working with soil, going back into nature, going to the beach, to the river. So there are things that you can do to become stronger, to make that center more stable. And now we move into the second center, which will develop from six months to two years of age. And it's, it's not root, it's sweetness. Isn't it the child when it's six months? Isn't it sweet? And everybody will want to eat it like a candy, but you cannot eat it because it's a baby. <laughs> but that's the feeling. It's so sweet and you want to squeeze it. And the center is located right in your abdomen. And also you can visualize it as your, your reproductive system also. And it's related to pleasures. And you see, babies are so about pleasures. They love to play with water. They love to play with the sand. They get so happy when they eat. They enjoy just touching the banana and pulling it all over their face and their clothes. Right? 